Hey, this is Vivian, realtor and uh, builder of a new house. So it's basically an old house, but it's going to be new because there's a lot of work that's being done on it. And it started with this shack. So let me show you this thing. Okay, here we go. Can I switch you back? Oh, I can't. That's what's happening. All right, well, then I'm going to just turn it and show you. So here we have the garage that's all new and it has a utility room behind it. Let's walk in here. Okay. So, all new roofing, beautiful in the corner. That's where we're gonna have the electrical panel. And over here, we're having a water heater. So this is the garage. There's a door that's supposed to go here. This door goes on the back. So you have a nice view of the outside. This the whole room here, I'm gonna take you around is a utility flex room. So the washer dryer will be over here, and then there's gonna be a sink, utility sink. This is closed up. There's gonna be a door there with a step down. Just so you know, this house is not on the ground, but the slab is, you can see. So what has to be built was this stem wall in between, and you fill it with cement. So they call this stem wall. It's all insulated. So off we go again out. And this time, I think I have my video on. I was doing this and it wasn't going on and now I found out why. Silly me. Okay, so you can see it's all being done with permits. And this is the main house. So this is what we bought. It had some wood up here but it only had um, one bathroom. We made it two bathrooms. We utilized the space that they built a hallway, which was a waste. It was only 936 square feet, this whole house. We added that sliding door. We extended the house in the back. I'll show you in a minute. So it's got three bedrooms, one bedroom here. The closets are there. One bedroom here with a window on the side. Closet over here. And then bathroom, the floor is open so they can finish up the plumbing. And that's gonna have a tub at the end there, tub shower. The front is where the living room is. Then you have the dining room area here. We have electrical that's going in for that. And then we have the kitchen in here. It's gonna be an L-shaped kitchen, sink, dishwasher on the shorter part of the L and the longer part has the stove and the refrigerator, and then you have the door to the utility, pantry, whatever that wants to be for you. Over here, and I'm gonna walk through the wall here, is the master bedroom. And what we did is we made a bathroom that's gonna have a barn door. This will slide open here. And the other door is here that opens from the kitchen area. It's going to have dual sinks here, toilet, and a shower. And this bathtub is going into the other bathroom. And then you can see how far, it's about five feet. We took out the wall here and we put in an extra five feet and planted it so that it's above ground, level with the rest of the house. And this will be this is where the end of the bedroom is, and then there's closets here. So there you have it, and a window. And then at the end of the house, where we extended it out even further for a patio. So beautiful, this patio. It's gonna have nice wood on the decking. This is just temporary plywood. And then we're gonna make a walkway here to the laundry room with the stair down. So that's what you have. And look at the neighborhood. New houses all around, new houses. They just dug this up over here to the left of this gray one. That is beginning a brand new house. So the neighborhood is just changing. And um, hi, me again. So it's really great to see this coming together. And um, my partner, she says she's gonna get it done in November 19th. So 
that is a hard, fast date. So we'll see how she does, but she's amazing. She's amazing, so we'll see. But anyway, that is what's happening with this project. And here's one more look, and then I'm gonna say, bye for now.